I had the weirdest fucking dream last night. Yeah? What was that dream about? It was the weirdest thing. You know how sometimes you get, like, sleep paralysis, you know? Yeah? Like, like, you're asleep, but yet you know you're asleep. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. So, I'm in this, I'm in this really weird state last night, you know? I'm like, oh my god, I'm asleep. I know I'm asleep, but how can I, how can I wake up, move around again? Then I legitimately thought to myself in my sleepy state, what if I just finger my butthole <coughs> and maybe that will wake me up? <laughs> what? Long story short, no, no, it didn't work. So you fingered your butthole and you stayed asleep. Actually, no, no. That was actually part of the dream. I fingered <laughs> my butthole, yet I was still asleep. <laughs> but, like, like, I thought I you actually did it. You know what that means, right? It. No, 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 no. See, you I know thought I means, right? actually did it, but I didn't do it, though. Don't you know what that means, right? Seems like you got what? some uh, repressed feelings there, you know. <laughs> the fact that something went up your butt and you were still content enough to stay asleep. You might have some uh, repressed feelings there. Well, what do, you, hey, what hey, do hey. you think, huh? There is nothing wrong with fingering your butthole. Nothing at all. No shame at all. And also not washing your hands afterward. Okay. Well, obviously, welcome to another episode of The Salt Box. Um, hey, hey, how are you guys all doing? Hey, hi. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Oh, yeah, did I mention I was recording? Yeah, why not? <laughs> uh, we've had a couple of drinks, so we decided it was a good idea to just talk a little bit. It's been a while exactly. since I did one of these. And, you know, by a couple of drinks, I mean, you know, one bottle of wine and seven beers and half a bottle go Schlager. Good times. Yeah, Gnarly Rage was supposed to be here, too. I gave him directions, but it seems like he took another left turn at Albuquerque and uh, decided to go to fucking bed like a bitch. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Ain't that just fucking disappointing. My God. Yeah, well, not really, actually. I, I, I mean, yeah, 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 di definitely disappointing. Yep. I am, uh... Yeah, yep. I incredibly disappointed that he's he's not here. Yeah, you know, it could be a third person that could share my, you know, fingering butthole story to you, you know? Yeah, yeah, and, and the fact that uh, you are not at all repulsed to the fact that that happened in the first place. Yeah, right? <laughs> well, to be fair, well, to be fair, I never actually fingered my butthole. It was only in the dream that this happened. You know, there is a difference. Oh, yeah, sure, sure. Yeah, well, thank you. I'm glad we I'm glad we can agree on this, you know. Yeah, in your dreams. Oh, wait a minute. Damn. Yeah. Bum, bum, bum. Ba -da -ba -ba -bum. So, faggot, I'm so happy. This week is a very good... This, this week is a very good week for me. You want to know why? Why? Because my first video... I finally got my first video that actually has a comma. Oh, you broke 1,000 views, huh? Yeah, yep. Yeah. I'm bad. so proud of that too. What yep. video was I'm that? I'm so happy. It was my first dick unstuck video. I'm so <laughs> mildly proud of it. Oh yeah, how to get your yep. uh, dick unstuck from a vacuum cleaner? Yeah, yep, yeah, that one. You know, you know, some people do gameplays, some people do tutorials. I make dick unstuck videos. That's that'll be my claim to fame. 
Hey, maybe you should come we... back to doing Fire Emblem Heroes videos, huh? Yeah, maybe. So... I could certainly make a half, somewhat half-assed attempt at it. Yeah. You, you just need to carve yeah. out your own niche. Yeah. Yeah, yep. How to get your dick unstuck from Fire Emblem Heroes. Oh, Perfect. I love it. Not that kind. I'm making it now. Yep. All right, whatever. Close enough. Yeah, right? So I decided in celebration of my first video breaking a thousand views, I'm going to rename February to squared you -ary. Yay, question mark? How about yay, quotation marks, and then question mark? <laughs> what if, what if you did a uh, left nutsack reveal? Yeah. That'll be at a million subs. A million. Oh, so you'd actually yeah. do it. I have no consistency here. Yep. At 50 subs, it's going to be a butt reveal. And then at a million subs, it'll be my, nut, it'll be my left nut reveal. Now, when you say it really it's going to be no a butt reveal, is it going to be like a bare ass or? Oh, you know. Put it this way, I'm probably going to have to upload it on my second channel over on Pornhub. <laughs> oh, you got, a, you got a channel on uh, Pornhub? You want to plug yeah. that real quick? Yeah! So that way uh, people can go and see, the, see your videos if they like the content on this particular video. They can go look you up on, on Pornhub. <laughs> Sure, why not? <laughs> that, 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 that absolutely, totally exists. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and you know, my video library in Pornhub is totally not me, you know, just figuring my butthole. I, I, I promise it's not just that. I got, I, I got other videos, too. <laughs> there's one where I actually, there's actually one where I actually just fist my butthole. Well, anyway, you, moving you on. on. So, I know I I had a really weird childhood, but anyway, moving on. How about all of this YouTube stuff, huh? Yeah. yeah. What about this YouTube stuff? Yeah. Yep. Uh, I don't know. I'm 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 kind of asking you here. Um. Oh. Uh. Making small talk here, man. Work with me. Come on. Come on. YouTube stuff. Yeah, YouTube stuff. Yeah. Yep. I mean, yeah. if, I, if I could take the tragedy of another person and turn it into my personal financial gain, well, I, I would probably be the smuggest, dumbest, I, I mean, the most popular and successful motherfucker on the planet, right? Yeah. Yep. Oh, I know can make it help. I I know what will help your channel blow up. You know. Yeah. Next, what's that? Next a little bit of controversy. Never hurt anybody, right? Yeah. Right. T t t tell you what. Tell you what. Next time you come to visit my area, you know, in the great old U.S. of A, what I'll do is I'll hang myself, and you can record my dead body. <sighs> Oh my god, I was just about yeah. to suggest you kill yourself also! Yeah, you know what? And, uh, and make a video out of it, yeah, that, that's cool too. Yeah, yep. And in that video will also be my face reveal. Yeah, I mean, you've already kind of revealed some of it in your videos. Yeah, yeah. Your scraggly little beard. It's goatee! It is a goatee. I don't know. It's it's kind of it's kind of long for that. And what about it? Fuck you. What's wrong with having a long goatee? That's that's fucking goateeism, you son of a bitch. Goateeism is a lot like racism, but worse. You son of a bitch.
got him right. <laughs> you, you can't see it right now, but I'm doing the Navy SEALs meme on the, the video. Navy SEALs meme. Oh, ain't that just fucking lovely? <sighs> I mean, if you did come back to doing Fire Emblem Hero stuff again, I think a unique thing that you could do is, since you are completely new to the series and have no prior experience or knowledge of anything regarding Fire Emblem at all, um... Anytime, like, new characters are released or something fucking happens in the game in regards to characters or something, you could do, like, a first impressions video where you give, like, your no-shit absolute first impressions of a character and just talk all the mad shit about them all. You might actually have yeah, to do a yeah. tiny bit of work and write some notes down and shit, and I know how abhorrent you are against... Yeah. You know, doing work or any anything with a modicum of effort put into it, you piece of shit. <laughs> but it's like this character right Yep. Like this character right here, I'm not sure if he has a penis or a vagina. This character right here, I know that he does not have a penis. And this character right here, I'm probably just gonna assume is either a boy and or girl. And this character right here is giving me the Y boner. And then you know what? You're you are not actually that far off. <laughs> that, what? that that can, you know, totally be said for a couple characters. That can be said for damn near all characters, unless they have facial hair, because then that's kind of obvious. Well, there's not, actually not, not that many characters that have facial hair, actually. And, and, and you know, I'm not I'm not saying that women can't have facial hair, you know. I'm not sexist or hairist, you know, however the however you want to say it. Well, what, what are you doing on your end? Oh, messing with pictures. I'm making it somewhat act uh, entertaining to actually look at. Oh my god. Yes. That picture. Yep, somewhat entertaining. <laughs> you were somewhat. Well, what do you what do you think about Fire Emblem in a nutshell anyway? In a nutshell, yeah. Well, all of the characters let me question my sexuality, um, and I have a hard time determining which one is a boy or a girl. What about what about the ones with huge titties? Are you saying that guys can have huge titties? Maybe. My God, that's you know you're so fucking sexist, man. My God. After all these years, and the truth finally comes out. My God. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you, you can you can guy. be or do anything you put your mind to. If you if you want to have a humongous fucking rack, then I guess go for it. What was that? Oh, nothing. Nothing at all. You kind of broke out there, you son of a bitch. You mean you broke up there a little bit, you son of a bitch. Oh, yeah, yeah, Yep, yeah. it's all your fault. Fuck you. Oh, man. You know, if, cause you know, if, if the girl has big titties, you know, and she has along the side of Godzilla, you know, <laughs> that's not gay. Not gay at all. Yeah, traps aren't gay. <laughs> exactly, yep. Oh, man. <laughs> Don't you have a thing or two to talk about, piece of shit? A thing or two to talk about. Besides, February now being renamed to Squareduary, because I'm celebrating, you know, 
my first viral video that just got over a thousand views. Yeah. Only took like what six months? No big deal, right? Only six months. I mean, yeah. it's technically taken me like over a decade to get like you know almost five k subscribers. Like, granted, yeah. I've only been doing like Fire Emblem Heroes for like six months, but I've mm -hmm. had a YouTube account for over a decade, and I've been uploading shit randomly. The only thing that blew up was like Fire Emblem. Nice. Boy, that just fucking special, man. That, that's pretty damn, that's pretty all right. In fact, I still have uh, those Call of Duty clips from way back when. Remember oh God, way I'm... back when we were, we were playing, I think... It was Black Ops 2, I remember that. Yeah, Black Ops 2 on the Xbox 360, and you chucked that fucking like, I'm... grenade, and you ended up, like, throwing it a bit too high, and it hit the lip on the ceiling of the window. And it bounced around, no. and you're like, what, what, what the fuck, what the fuck, what the fuck? And then it, you fucking killed yourself with your own grenade. <laughs> and then it killed me. Oh my god. Yep. I'm like, wow, I'm not even mad at that. was amazing. <laughs> Amazingly stupid. That should be Actually, something I... like uh, your, your fucking username on Xbox back then was like Spartan4056. Spartan, yeah, yep. Yeah, so it's like Spartan Way 4056, yep. Call of Duty fail, or some shit like that. It's still on my yep. YouTube somewhere. Like, literally the other day, I got a notification on Facebook that that memory was shared like five years ago. Oh, yeah. Yep. I'm having a lot of memory on my Facebook, actually, from all the fucking videos from Black Ops 2. Those oh, were kind of holy funny. Shit. Those were kind of funny, yep. I'm still proud of that grenade, though, five years later. Actually, come to think of it, this is the salt box. And I almost yes. forgot to ask the question, what is making you salty today? Even though I already know what the answer what is. is. What is making me salty today? Yeah, what? Is. What is making me salty, dude? The fact that fingering my butthole is considered gay? No, it's not gay at all. Nothing wrong with that. It, it didn't even happen. It was all in the dream. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, man. My god. Jeez, fucking assume me. My god. That's not making you salty. That's making me salty. What? What is making you salty? What is making you a literal salt factory? Making me a literal salt factory. Making me a literal salt factory. Why am I so salty? The fact that it took us two hours to win a game on Overwatch. <laughs> Perhaps. <laughs> that's kind of that's kind of salty. Well, I guess more on that point is the fact that we can't go like literally just one single fucking game without having both a Hanzo and a Widowmaker on our team on and fucking Anna. attack. <laughs> and sometimes a fucking yep. Anna, just like all the fucking snipers. Like why well, the fuck? To be, fair, to be fair, I can I I can deal with Anna. She's okay. You know? Yeah, she's a fucking At healer. She's somewhat support. useful. Yeah. Like so, what if you can't shoot the enemy? At least you can shoot the fucking team. <laughs> I and mean, if you if you have a hard jump? time shooting the enemy, you can at least hit one of your friends in the face with your dart. Or just lob a grenade at him, you know. Yeah. He says, I love you, like, throwing a healing grenade to the face, you know? Like, here, I love you, now let me shoot you in the face with this healing dart. But no, like, literally... Fuck, I can't even remember the last time we had a game where we didn't have 
a Hanzo or a Widow or a Hanzo and a goddamn Widow on our fucking team. Yep. Like, oh and they are both my in a party God. too. Yep. I'm he, to they're myself. usually in a party. Yep. And I'm like, well, I guess I'm just going to go fucking cut myself. My God, this yep, is fucking I horrible. Yeah, I didn't want to fucking win today. I guess that's fucking fine. Yeah, I'll just be a fucking right. roadhog and charge the enemy team's ult so I can get this fucking over with as soon as goddamn possible. Yeah, that's pretty much this too, is the goddamn... Ah. <sighs> Just makes you want to fucking smash your face through some sort of fragile object. Yeah. Yeah. Like, granted, I like, like playing fucking Hanzo every once in a while and getting unfair fucking kills on tanks by taking all 500 of their HP with a single scatter arrow and everything, but at least I don't fucking do it um, on attack damn. where I can't fucking kill anything or get constantly mm -hmm. outsniped by the enemy Widowmaker because they already know where you're going to be because they're on defense, not attack. Exactly. So I guess yep. you could say I'm pretty fucking salty about that shit, too. And in the end, you're like, oh, no, we lost. Oh, how oh, the fuck every, did everything we Everything was lose? going so good. With three no. fucking snipers on attack. Oh, who would have fucking get that? We would have fucking lost. With three snipers on fucking attack. Right? Goddamn right. Yep. Perhaps. <sighs> Perhaps. <laughs> oh my god at least we finally got that fucking win yeah yep. I could have sworn it would be like all the other ones where you would choke at the last possible second oh yep we had someone decide they want to go full team sniper to try oh to yeah not. It's got it it's got like, so bad to the point that in order to avoid this shit, I had to go into the arcade and play Mystery Heroes. So there's no way somebody can pick a sniper on fucking purpose. Yep. Like I almost want them to nerf Widow just so we can like have a break from her, just like not oh, see her in every fucking game ever. Yep. It's like every fucking player who plays Overwatch on the PS4 has seen our video when we actually won with all attack snipers. And they're like, oh man, I want to do what they did. And so they just like, keep trying to be snipers and try to copy what we did at one time. <laughs> that one time. That one, that one time. <sighs> Oh man! So what's it what's it gonna take for you to start playing Fire Emblem again? For me to start pl playing Fire Emblem Heroes. So you haven't touched it in a couple months. Oh please, it's been four months. <laughs> Yeah. Well, you know, I, 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 oh, you know, like it started out, it started off so strong, you know, I got a couple hundred views here and there, but I mean, you know, like I put like four or five hours into a video and they barely broke 30 views, you know? I care. Well, um,. We started ow, ow, using ow, this. Ow, ow. What the fuck? Um. Sorry, my pussy's attacking my feet. I mean, my, I mean, my 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 cat is attacking my feet. So yeah, my pussy's ta my pussy is attacking my feet. Anyway, <laughs> have you heard of? Uh -huh. uh, I think it's called Du Recorder. Du Recorder. Yeah. 
It sounds like an instrument that I used back in elementary. That I used in, back in elementary school. Why? Well, it's a it's a pretty handy um, hashtag. Not sponsored, by the way. <laughs> um, <laughs> it it oh, happens so to be a, a, a handy free recording and editing app. That I'm actually using these days because the default one I usually use is really fucking glitchy. But you can actually record your gameplay, whatever you're doing, and then take that footage, uh, edit it in there, trim whatever you need. You can even put in a background for you know Fire Emblem Heroes, the horizontal situated phone games. So that way, like when you upload that footage to YouTube, it's not just black bars on the side. Man, it. I'm so proud that you finally sold out. I mean, uh, use your resources. But I, I, you, I then it's, it, so awesome. it's free, and I'm also not sponsored, and I'll probably never be sponsored because I'm a piece of shit. Oh, man. <laughs> I'd sponsor you, you son of a bitch. No, you won't. Then I can go tell. Yeah. Well, then I tell my mom and dad, Mom, Dad, I sponsored my bestest buddy friend. Thank it. No, you won. And then they'll say, "Kid, we have no idea who you are, but please get the fuck out of our house. This is the third and come over here this month." <laughs> but yeah, you, the the hours you spent previously wouldn't take as long now because you could just simply take your footage, put a background. On there, and I, I would help you out a bit, give you a whole bunch of the backgrounds I've already made, similar to the salt box that we're looking at right now. I'll let you have those images; you can use them in backgrounds, and also use them in thumbnails, so that that cuts down on your thumbnail making time significantly. And I've given those backgrounds right. to a lot of other Fire Emblem Heroes content creators too. Metakite, Sage Master, you yep. might have seen them around a bit. Oh, no, I have not. I have no idea who the fuck you're talking about right now. Well, actually, I was like, uh, I kind of went off in a tangent, and I was talking to the audience for a split second there. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, fuck off. Yeah, I'd be like, you know, this is you know, a, I mean, you an A to B conversation. See your way out. Yep. I mean, you know, you know, you got some people that make Fire Emblem Heroes. I make dick suck videos. You know, I mean, it's pretty much the same thing, you know, but. You know, it's, it's minor, minor alterations, you know? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, oh my god. Maybe you ought to do more of those skit kind of videos. Yeah. I've actually got a lot of my friends that have seen, like, I've seen, like, my IRL friends down at. Down in the town next over. They're yeah. like, oh my god, Pat. Dude, can we be in your videos? I'm like, oh my god. Hey, maybe you should do that. Maybe you should, like, popularity 90% of the time just fucking happens. Especially not on purpose. Especially not on purpose. I know. Exactly. Because, yep. like... I made the don't spend your orbs video without the slightest intention of that shit like blowing up the way it did. But yeah. it did. It got probably the highest views ever thus far. So I, I took it and ran with it. In fact, the YouTube notification and pop-ups that tell you when your video gets like popular, like, oh, hey, you're video got over this is your first video that got over like 10,000 views or some shit <laughs> that'd be funny Yay! if it actually said it in the notification and it's like well yep. you should take this video and learn what made it so popular in the first place possibly re uh, replicate what made it successful in the first place I was like oh hell yeah I'll do that and then uh, the meme started to run wild and the, the popularity carried it couple thousand subs and then it burned itself out now it's just a stale meme that reddit uses to shit all over me 
pretty much every other yeah, month. You know. <laughs> yeah, you know. It might be like, congrats, your video just hit 15,000 views. And just like that, your, your parents will let you back in the family will again. Yay! Yeah. Yeah, it's totally that important. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So important that I treat it like it is absolutely not important at all. Yeah, yep. I, I did the, like the daily upload thing, but that, that burns you out pretty fucking quick. So now yeah. I, I'm reprioritizing how I do YouTube, and I just kind of upload when I have the time, when I feel like it, which isn't very often anymore. But Yeah, yep. i if... get all these... Yeah, you know, I'll make a meme happen, you know, I'll become popular and be like, yo, dad, I'm totally internet famous, can you, uh, can you, can you come back to our fan, please? You know, I forgive you for walking out, you know? Yeah. Didn't your dad write you back into the well because you made diamond rank, though? No, that was my mom that, that wrote me back in the will. Oh, my dad okay. still walked off the family, though, unfortunately. Oh, okay. Well, you're 50% of the way there. What was that? I say you're fifty percent of the way there. Yeah, halfway there, you know. Yeah. Let's well, see. You now I got Diamond Ray Overwatch, and then I'll become somehow famous, and my dad will come back to the will come back to the family. Good deal. I had yeah. a very weird childhood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just upload what makes you feel happy and what you actually want to share, and you'll be a lot more satisfied at the end rather than. Yay. You know, specifically putting the time and effort into a thing that may never come to fruition. Yeah. Okay. And that's your moment of strategist. Yeah, fuck you. Imagine that I'm, I'm you. giving you the middle finger right now. Okay. Aw. Fuck you too, buddy. Fuck you too. Yeah, fuck you. And fuck yeah. me, especially fuck me. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there we are. Yeah. Mm. God. I'm about to go fucking pass out. It is currently 4 a.m. where I am at right now. Well, <laughs> goddamn. Well, I guess before we end the video, uh,. Why don't, why don't you tell the fans what your, or who your favorite Fire Emblem character is? Uh, my favorite character is that one girl that will put me on a government watch if I keep staring at her. Do you remember her name? Um, I'm going to call her Jailbait. <laughs> okay. But for a real answer... Which one's your favorite character? And if, if you don't know which one, then uh, say whatever character's name that you do remember, because that probably means you give slightly more of a shit about that particular character than the other ones, because you actually gave enough of a shit to remember their name. Okay, um... Well, there, there was that one character, I think his name was, uh... His name was uh, Butch, you know? Yep, his name was Butch. Um, yeah, yep, his name was Butch. He was a very good guy. Had a kind of feminine body, you know? You know, you, you know that character, Butch, right? Of course you do. I know you're still bullshitting me. Then, uh, then there was that one character um, who's very remember. That was very rememberable. Re I'm going to call her... Um, NPC number three, you know? God, she, she certainly was, certainly was amazing, you know? Uh, you know, you know, yeah, yep. You know, in her, you know, dicks could touch, and it wouldn't be gay at all, yep. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say that your favorite character is Camilla. Yeah, sure. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh, come. Camilla's pretty awesome too. You know that w that one girl with the big titties. Yeah. Yeah, that's Camilla. 
Okay. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah. I thought I just. I thought I just play it safe. Yep. One with the. I ironically, the Fire Emblem fandom. A lot of people in the community don't like her because she looks like a ravenous slut. <laughs> Dude, I no no no. I think I actually picked her once for in the uh, the something that like way back in fucking September. I want to say. Yeah, I think you did summon her, and then you also picked her in the voting gauntlet. Yep. Like yeah yeah yeah. It was the it was the voting gauntlet. What it was. Yeah. Yep. Like, I opened up into like two, I went in for like maybe four seconds, and I'm like, oh, look, one character, big titties, done, she's mine, boom. Yep. Let's make this shit happen. Yep. yep. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a simple man, I see tits. I choose. Yep. Maybe, you know what? Here's, here's an idea. Maybe you should try to collect every female character in the game. And then just make a whole bunch of teams of nothing but, like, female characters. Yeah. Dudes are yeah. overrated. Fuck them. I mean, yeah. like, not yep. fuck them. Fuck the ladies, because that's sexy. Okay. <laughs> I'll have two teams. I'm going to call them... It'll be, it'll be, like, SEAL Team 6 and SEAL Team... And, you know, like, the SEAL Team, you know, and the Navy SEALs. But um, instead of, like, Navy SEALs, it's going to be, like, Fat Team 1 and Fat Team 2. Yep. Well, that's that's actually kind of funny because I do have an entire team that I made that are all female characters, and they all have different hair colors. And you're you're not going to know what I, uh, I'm talking about for a second here, but they're uh, Fjorm, Cordelia, Azura, and Tharja, and they all have different hair colors. So I call them Stretch Angels because. Charlie's Angels was a bunch of girls with they were they were pretty much different in every way and they all had different hair colors so yeah that's that's the name reference of that particular team Oh nice yeah 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 you know I almost had the female version of the A team of Fire Emblem Heroes but unfortunately it didn't pan out sadly Yeah and nothing you ever do ever pans out I know. Yeah, but but to be fair though, you know, a female A team, I think it's a bad idea because you know we had like a female, like an all female Ghostbusters, and it didn't pan out too well, did it? Did ooh, it? ooh, ooh, uh, ooh, ow, oh ooh. yeah, oh, 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 ow, oh, yeah, I know. Yep. So the world probably was ready for a female A team anyway, so it all pans out. I mean, I'd I'd go for a double D team. Uh, well, dun, got anything dun. to say before uh, we sign off for the video? Uh, let's see now. Um, I'm going to say uh, don't smoke crack. Inhale it. Uh, we, we don't condone the smoking or inhaling of crack. On this YouTube channel, yep. um, Pop Papa YouTube, da Daddy YouTube, please don't demonetize me. Yep, yep. And also once, if you, well, and also once I hit these subs, I'll be doing a bot reveal. You know, totally over on Pornhub. You know, yeah, it's, it's gonna happen. It's just gonna go down. It's gonna go down. It's gonna go down to funky town. Fuck yeah. <laughs> <sighs> All righty, guys. Like the video if you fucking liked it. 
Yep. Yep. And uh, let us know uh, in the comments um, down below if you actually watched the entire thing. Uh, what what key code word or code phrase should they say in the comments if they watched all the way to the end? P squared. Uh, let's see now. Um, I want to say uh. Let's see now. Let's see now. Let's see now. Um, hashtag me too. <laughs> I was actually not expecting that. You, you got me. Wow. I know. I'm at least go to hell in at least four different religions. But yeah, if you've seen, if you've seen the whole video all the way through, just reply in the comments. Hashtag me too. And yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. We have uh, we have got to stop making these videos at four o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Fuck.